Good Friday. We are unboxing a new old stock seven inch pan today. I didn't own a new seven inch pan. This one is very nice, but if you look at it with a magnifier glass, you can see little micro scratches on, on top of the waffling. This one I love. It's the smooth seven inch skillet. I purchased this used. It looks like it was never used. I count this as new. He puts it in a priority mailbox. You can hear it. Can't you just put a little packing to stop it from rolling around inside the box? They sell the seven inch pans in boxes and in plastic packages. This is a plastic package. Make it easy to open, will ya? Oh, I hope it's not broken. Anyway, try to avoid price gouging. If you pay a lot for one of these, it just encourages them to abuse the prices. That's not much packing in that, in that big box. I'm just saying. Okay. Oh, I could, I'll use this. That's, that's a fun. All right, looks good. Looks good. See, they come in these plastic packages. That's how I got my nine inch skillet. It's a 1987. Now we gotta cut it open. That's what we gotta do. Will it open by itself? Now I get the scissors. I know, I know. Brittle, very brittle. Yeah, it's very brittle. So brittle, it still won't come off. I'm just saying. So now I will have a new skillet. And if I scratch it up, I scratch it up. Nobody else but me. Here we go. Here we go. 1987. That's pretty. She's pretty. Do the egg flip in this one. Let's hold it up to the light. Just so you know, even new ones, not, I don't see any defects in this one, but sometimes you'll get a brand new pan and it'll have these little squiggly lines or bubbles. And that's just part of the glass making process. Vision seven inch skillet. France, France, made in France. Thanks for watching.